guys, how's it going? My name is Alexon and welcome back everybody to today's episode of the Minecraft Survival Let's Play. We're with episode 4, so if you guys all can hit that like button and leave some feedback down below in the comment sections, that would be amazing as always. So guys, as you guys can see, the house is a bit different. I don't know if you guys can pick up on the fact that the roof has been changed a bit, so now we can actually fit uh, uh, two by two windows. So you basically have a nice, even, and symmetric house. So before there was an issue because if I did put four windows, it would be hitting the bottom, and this would be like one level higher. So it was all confused for some reason, and I did fix that off screen. So everything should be complete and well to go. And basically, uh, I added these little uh, wooden columns or whatever you guys want to call them, support beams. And yeah, I just kind of wanted to go for a cabin feeling, and I think I did. I think I did pretty well. I don't know. Let me know in the comment sections. Uh, but yeah, we have a lot of things to do today as an episode, and I want to talk about what we're going to be doing and how things are going to work with this house as well. So, the main plan for this house is it's going to be kind of like a spawn area. Uh, for example, basically it's going to be the resting house. So I'll have a bed, maybe a fireplace, some seating areas, and really not have this place for storage because really it's not going to be too convenient, not too much space. But it is something more for design and kind of like having a nice spawn if I die and I have my bed here. So I think that'll be pretty decent. I hope you guys will support that. Also, I did add a sunroom here just if we wanted to have some more light. But let me know in the comment sections what do you guys think about that idea. And now to replace the storage room and how that's going to work. Basically, as I mentioned, was that this area is going to expand with wood and almost go all the way. Actually, it will go all the way to the other side of the mountain, almost basically like a deck. So that's the idea. It's going to be like a big patio going all the way across. And down here, the main idea is basically it's going to have some pillars, supporting beams, a nice entrance, something really um, interesting looking like support beams, a nice roof, everything that would look pretty nice with this uh, design. And it'll be all under that patio that I was talking about. And once we go down here, we'll have like certain storage rooms, each storage room having their own theme. One can be a farm, one can be an enchantment room, storage room, armor room, all those cool things that I think would be very interesting and unique because, you know, I kind of feel like I've always been storing things inside uh, uh, homes and it really just limited me from space and stuff so I think this would be really unique as well and I feel like uh, moving our farm in here will be pretty cool and having a nice big storage room and I think it would just add to this um, uniqueness I guess of this location that's why I kind of like this hill because of this weird entrance here but I think we can make it work pretty well and I'd like to know from you guys in the comment sections what do you guys think about that but moving on guys I want to show you guys um, this really cool place I found that's not too far away from home and I'm just gonna tell you guys right away It's basically an abandoned mine shaft, but what's interesting about it is that it's actually in a big crevasse and um, It's just like opened up and it's a snow biome as well So it's like covered up by snow and when I was walking by like I saw some wood But I was like, you know, this doesn't look much like like anything really right now So I just kind of walked by it, but then when I walked back from where I was going I actually found that it was an abandoned mine shaft and I actually wanted to go explore it in today's episode a bit and uh, not go too far in because I don't have a lot of resources and things but basically just enough to see what's going on down there and after that we'll go back to the house we'll work on things over there but uh, let me show you guys there it is right there so that is the area I was just talking about and I think it's gonna be awesome once we go and explore more about it and see what's all about I don't want to go too far because I don't have um, too many resources just to keep safe or anything like that so I'm gonna just go explore around and see what there is to offer around here something really cool maybe we can find some things that are gonna be useful but yeah just I wanted to explore it because I found it really interesting um, so let's just go this way and see what they have um, I definitely want to grab some of this oh, oh I hear some mobs there you guys are all right so I'm gonna take you guys out but I want to get some of this oh my gosh there's a lot of you guys what in the world Alright, calm down guys. I'm just here to visit, not here to take out this place. But these stone block or these blocks I want to use for builds and things like that, etc. Um, but whoa. Alright, this place is pretty dangerous, but I see a lot of good um, redstone, lapis lazuli, a lot of good gear around here that we could possibly use in uh, episodes and things like that. Alright, let's go uh, look around. This is like a dead end, I believe. Yeah. Let's just go straight and see what we can find around here because this looks like an open area. And, whoa, mobs. Okay. Oh, yes, there's a chest. All right, cool. All right, so let's go check that out. But first of all, I want to take out this mob area just because I don't feel too safe with them around here, if that makes any sense. I don't want to die. I'd rather just get some peace and quiet. All right, what is going on in here? What type of spawner is this? All right, so this is a spider spawner. Um, interesting. I could block it off and use it or maybe get a silk touch pickaxe and maybe make it an enchantment area. Or not enchantment, but for like XP and stuff. So that's something I could consider, and I'm going to block it off right now, even though I just have wood. 
Uh, I'm just going to block it off for us to use. And I will make sure to uh, keep this place in mind next time for anything that we do. All right, let's go check out that chest area. And I'll probably pretty much that's going to be for this um, abandoned mine shaft. And we'll come back here for more resources and things like that. But let's check it out. Oh, yes, there we go. Oh, that's actually really good. We got a saddle and a book. Uh, a few diamonds, few, few lapis lazuli, and some bread. But I'm going to take all this and get out of here before I die from any mobs. Uh, but this is definitely going to be really uh, useful for us because I think we, with the books, if we get some obsidian, we can actually make ourselves an enchantment table. And with diamonds, we're good. With a saddle, we can actually get a horse, which will definitely make life much easier with just exploring and running around instead of wasting time and things like that. That's going to be awesome. All right, so let's get ourselves out of here because uh, this place is full of mobs and everything so yeah i'm just gonna make my way out of here as fast as possible and see what happens all right guys i'm um, sorry about that but we're back and i'm going to go back to the top as i mentioned because this place is not too safe it's it's full of uh mobs and everything like that so we're gonna go to the top back to the house and i'm gonna show you guys around on basically what is happening um and what we're gonna do i think we're gonna work on that little hole that i talked about and see if we can maybe put in a storage room for now because we're kind of getting all unorganized with storage and things. So I kind of want to probably get that done um, this episode and maybe move the farm stuff as well. That could be something we'd be looking forward to to working on. And uh, yeah, and then this is something also to, also to consider is all the f uh, pigs around here. We can actually use that and the, uh, the cows are up there, I believe, as well. We can actually use that to make ourselves a little farm area for animals and get food and not have to go hunting them down. But yeah, look how awesome the house looks, guys. It looks pretty nice. I like it. And it's going to be really nice having that uh, patio as well across the house going all the way to the other side of the mountain. And with that little entrance underground, that's going to make all those cool rooms and things like that. All right, so I'm going to drop off all this gear that we just got just now. And I kind of want to make an enchantment table, but we don't have any lava around here. So that's probably going to be something we're going to do next episode. And I know someone mentioned to do an enchantment table with the diamonds we had. Um, and I took that advice, and I think we're going to do that. And maybe some diamond tools from what other people said as well. So that's pretty awesome. When I make that enchantment table, I will let you guys know who said the comment. There was a few of you guys, but I'll pop up some of the comments on episode 5. Alright, so I'm going to just store all the valuables uh, first off because that's going to be the most important thing for us right now. And then any junk I'll just put in there as well because I don't have the organization with me right now. Um, other than that, I think we're doing pretty well with everything else here. But yeah, I want to show you guys the new... Actually, yeah, let's go do that right now. Let's go work on the... Um what's called the storage room because I kind of got to get that fixed right away or got to get that done right away and it's just going to be the first room and that's going to be pretty much okay with me um and then once we go actually let's no that should be fine yeah first room is good and I'll just open it up once we get in I'm going to try to make each room organized as much as possible but actually no this should not work this would not work out all right forget this room um because I need to make it even about even so what we'll do is we'll make it by four, and right here, we'll make the main entrance. Because I want to make it even, and actually, we can actually use that room to connect everything. Because um, I want this storage room to be pretty big, because I am going to have all the chests organized with only specific blocks. I kind of never did that, and I kind of want to try that, just because I think it would be pretty interesting and cool looking as well. So, that is something I'm going to be doing. I'm just going to probably just clean out this room. I should have maybe made an uh, enchantment table because we do have plenty of XP and we do have some lava down at the area we just went so I could possibly do that right now. Let's actually just clear out this room quickly and then we'll do the enchantment actually in this episode. We'll actually get that done uh, by this episode which would be pretty fantastic. So yeah, we're going to do that. I'm going to get a water bucket, fill it up, bring some, get some obsidian if that's possible and if not then yeah, that's no big deal. Uh, I should probably keep that like that so we know which side is the doorway that's the doorway and we're gonna make it let's see from the doorway it's one two uh so one two so from here it's one and two and then we'll just clear it out all the way to the other side and yeah, it should be a pretty decent sized space and also we're gonna go up by like two more blocks just to give it some headroom as well and besides that, this room will come along pretty well. I don't have any torches on me. I would have put a few down, which reminds me, I got to get some coal. And I think, is it turning dark right now? It kind of looks like it would be turning dark. But if anything, I'll grab some sleep and we'll probably move the bed inside the house. So yeah, there's a lot of things happening right now, which is pretty exciting because 
we got a lot of work to do with this place. It, it definitely needs some help with uh, design and we got to just organize everything. I'm also, also going to be changing it to stone brick because um, that will look the best, I think. So yeah, this is pretty much the room, how it's going to look. We'll get some chests in here. We're going to make one more layer up and we're probably going to like wrap it around with uh, wood and put some nice designs, almost like a factions kind of storage room if you guys uh, know what I'm talking about. Something similar to that would be pretty cool as well, having some pillar designs and all those cool things that you guys have probably seen in Faction Let's Plays as well. So that's kind of what the design appeal is going to be, if you guys have seen some of that. So that's going to be pretty cool. Once that's done, we'll basically not have to worry about unorganization. And we'll probably get things done more efficiently because now we know what uh, chests have certain items. And again, we should make go to the nether eventually. I don't know what episode that will be, but it is turning night. So I'm going to go grab some sleep. Um, get some rest quickly and then uh, we actually will go and do an enchantment quickly because I think that's pretty much pretty needed right now um, So I'm gonna move this bed inside the house and then we'll go straight to sleep and then right after that We'll be pretty much good to go. I'm just gonna put the bed right here for now Hopefully we can get some sleep. There we go And uh, I think it would be okay to get the obsidian. We have the books. We have the diamonds. Why not? I think it's it's a decent idea um, because there's a lot of things we can do in this episode, like working in those rooms. But I think you guys would really like to see um, the uh, enchantment table done and getting an enchantment as well. So do I even have any more iron left? I was trying to look for that. There you go. So let's make ourselves that bucket quickly. Uh, let's just make a few. I don't know why I'm making that many, but, you know, whatever. It is what it is. And I'm going to get some water from down here, which reminds me this farm is going to have to be... Uh, fixed around next episode once we work more in that room like that would be specifically um, I guess for those rooms um, the farm like episode 5 will be more of just working inside that cave like all I did right there was to kind of just grab some area for some chests and once we get back with the enchantment we'll be pretty much good to go with um, working on the enchantment and then probably putting a few chests and just organizing it that way as best as possible. So let's make our way across. I should probably make a bridge or get some boats or maybe make like a dock. That would be a cool idea as well. I'd like to know from you guys in the comment sections about that. And uh, all right, let's hope we can get this done quickly because I don't want to make this like a 30 minute video. I want to keep it kind of decent, like around 20 minutes and hopefully we'll find something around here. If only this was a lava pool, that would have been on point that would have been so perfect right now but it's not so we got to go get some lava um, from down here and I think it's right around here I saw it on this side I'm pretty sure I saw it on this side let's see where you are I know there's lava around here somewhere all right let's just jump down since we're already here and I think we should be able to hold this off yeah there we go okay I did see a skeleton there so I gotta take him out okay he's dead um, where is their lava. There it is. All right. So hopefully that's a lava pool. If not, then we're in bad luck right now. Um, but let's go see what we can do around here. I don't think it is a lava pool. Oh man. Well, that actually does suck. Uh, yeah, that's not going to work out. We got to go find a lava pool really quickly right now. And that's not going to work. Probably not at all. So, uh, we hit bad luck. That's bad luck. Actually pretty much sucks. There's nothing else I can do. Maybe I can go down here and find some lava. That'd be pretty awesome to be honest. Um, but there was that opening, and I thought I did see lava. Oh, wait a minute. This could be good luck here. Let's see if this is some type of lava functioning little area for us. Uh, that continue to go down here? Let's see. Yes, it is. Okay, let's jump down. Ah, oh, man, it's really not much lava around here. This kind of sucks. Oh, wait, there we go. Lava pool. Perfect. Obsidian. Man, we're in luck right now. We got some good luck, so that's awesome. Cool, so let's grab some of this. Uh, let's see if there's any lava down here before I just go and jump in to lava. So we just need three, and then we'll make our way back to the house. And we pretty much have ourselves an enchantment table, episode four. Pretty, pretty good. Got to be honest myself. Awesome stuff. All right, so that's one down, two more to go. And then we can make an awesome pickaxe. Hopefully we can get some efficiency or silk touch or fortune. Something that's going to be decent. And we'll probably make ourselves a, a diamond sword as well. And get those tools settled up as good as possible. As fast as possible as well. Because we need them. And we're done. We pretty much have the obsidian. And I should probably get more for the... Um, what's it called? Um, the nether portal. Yeah, but I don't think I'm going to need that right now. We'll probably do that in future episodes. No rush right now for that. Oh my goodness. That would have been a bad story, but I do have water buckets on me, so we would have been safe. So we're good, we're good, we're good. Let's just get ourselves out of here as fast as possible and make our way back home. Make that enchantment table, and then once that's done, we're pretty much good to go uh, with everything else. And we'll pretty much be 
good to finish off this episode. So yeah, I think this was a good episode to be honest. So let's make our way to the top right from here. Doesn't matter where. And then get that enchantment table done. Let's just hope we get some good, um, I guess some good levels. Uh, some good levels of XP and everything for quality enchants. If we can get some luck, that would be awesome. Uh, we have 19 levels. That should be okay for like what we need really. Am I going to fail this jump? No, I'm not. Alright, sweet. Now we can make our way back home. Awesome! So we did find the obsidian. I was praying that we'd find some and we did. So that would have been bad luck if we didn't. That would have been really bad luck. Because then there would be no point to that journey. But yeah, we're doing good now. We got our uh, obsidian. Three obsidian. Let me double check. Yes, we do. Awesome. And then I believe it's just two diamonds and a book on the top. And that should be the enchantment table, guys. Awesome! And um, let's get that done. And then I'll probably just put some uh, chests inside that storage unit. Work on that a bit off screen to get the design appeal. And then by next episode, we'll have the chest room complete. We'll store some things in there. Work on the farm. Um, and see what else we can do. Maybe get a horse as well. And get things going with that patio that we talked about. The big uh, deck area. So, enchantment table. Here we come. And we have to make an enchantment room as well. That's a good point. Alright, so, uh, diamonds, let's grab the diamonds from here, and let's grab the book, let's get the obsidian layered like this, wait, let's just make sure I'm doing this right, oh my goodness, I think, it was, oh my goodness, alright, it was actually four, why did I mess that up, alright, it was four, I'm gonna go back, I'm gonna pause the recording, get one more back, if not, get enough for a nether portal, so I never have to go back to that area, and I'll see you guys in just a few. Alright guys, so I just got back and uh, you have no idea, like I'm never gonna go visit that place ever again. That place has no soul. It could have just reminded me at least, so I got a good amount actually. I got 13, so we're safe forever. We never have to worry ever again about this chaos that happened today. Um, so let's put this like this. I believe one in the middle and two diamonds on this side. And then the enchantment table. And there it is. Oh boy, enchantment table achieved. Oh, enchanter achieved. Alright, pretty good. Not bad. All right, so we got 12 more, so we'll have enough to make um, another portal, and we'll actually make that in a separate room, and uh, we got to get books for enchants. Oh, I forgot about that, but you know what? At this point, I don't really care. I'll get like a small enchant on like, uh, maybe like, a, let's get actually a good enchant on a, let's see if we can get like an iron pickaxe maybe, and some swords. We have some swords. All right, that's good enough, because... I'm not really gonna bug about right now like having the books and getting perfect enchants. It's only episode 3. I need to get some stuff. So for now, we'll just put it in this room like this. And I'll just get ourselves the iron pickaxe. Oh my gosh, I forgot the lapis. Do I have any on me? No, I do not. It is at the house. Man, this is just an off day for me. I keep on forgetting little things like that. Alright, um, I wish they just never bothered with putting lapis. But I guess it helps for enchants. I don't know. Uh, so let's grab that quickly. There we go. And let's get those enchants done. And after that's complete, we're pretty much good. We'll just have to put some st storage stuff in here. Or maybe not for next episode. Who knows? Let's see. Let's just get efficiency. That's pretty much all we can get right now. So I'm not, I'm fine with that. Efficiency is pretty good. There we go. Efficiency one. Let's get this uh, sword in here. Sharpness one. Awesome. Pretty good. Happy with that. Um, I'm just enchanting all this gear just for the heck of it. Why not? I gotta be honest. Like, why not? Um... Let's see, unbreaking or let's just get efficiency as well. There we go. So we got our, you know what, why not? We're here in the moment. Let's just go for it. <laughs> efficiency 2 shovel. That's awesome. So there we go, guys. We just did our enchants. We got that done. Um, decent, you know what, let's just do the armor. No, 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 that's going to be for better enchants later. 10 XP left. Plenty of more to go mining and stuff. So I'll fl find plenty of XP or get plenty of XP. So that's not a big deal as well. But yeah, like we got some decent stuff here like not bad at all just for like no books or anything like that so I'm, I'm pretty happy with that let's be honest it's not the worst thing ever uh, let's get the chests quickly and you know what I, I think we'll do that next episode there's really no time for that next episode we'll work on the chest room we'll kind of get that layered out designed properly and eventually we'll get this patio complete um, and just showing you guys how it's gonna look it's basically, I think we're going to go with a lighter wood or we can go for a darker wood. But all it is, is just going to continue out in this direction like this. And it's going to go up to about there. And it's all it is, is just going to expand all the way out to the other side of this hill and connect. And basically under this will be the chest and storage room and all those other uh, areas for us to go and see. And I'll put some fences here. But yeah, that's how it's going to look. I think it's going to be pretty nice. I think it's going to have a, a cool design. 
Uh, but yeah, guys, if you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure you guys all hit that like button, subscribe if you guys are new, and I'll see you guys next time with more Survival Let's Play. Peace out, guys.